now I have to start all over again. When it comes to sex, the actual act, I'm not interested. It all seems so undignified, but I have to play the game. And after years of trying to look normal, I think I've met the right woman for me. Deb saved her life on a domestic dispute call, introduced us, and we've been dating for six months now. Dexter. Perfect timing. Aster and Cody are at the babysitter for the night, so I'm ready whenever you are. Great. Where are we going? I was hoping you'd surprise me. If you don't have any ideas, though, I was thinking we'd head down to the beach. There's this nice little crab place I've heard about. Sure, I'll try anything once. Great. Thank you, Dexter. It's so rare we get a chance to go out at all, especially just the two of us. Yeah, it's definitely important to get out there and do stuff. It's not that, really. It's just, it's been over a year since what happened with my ex-husband, and I feel like I've spent that time either working or being a mom. Sometimes I forget who I am without all that. Maybe I'm just in a rut. Well, if smashing crabs will help you feel better, I'm in. Thank you, Dexter. I really appreciate you being so supportive. I've been thinking lately about us and about how patient you've been. I'm not really the happy type. You're right. I'm being silly. I shouldn't have brought it up. Sure. Needless to say, I have some unusual habits, but all these socially acceptable people can't wait to pick up hammers and smash their food to bits. Normal people are so hostile. But not Rita. Harry would be proud. I have to control the dark passenger or he'll control me.
Where are we going? Looks like a crime scene. They might need me. Oh. Okay. For your own safety and appetite, you should stay here. Don't worry, I'll be right back. Frustrate my dark passenger. Where are we going? Looks like a crime scene. Oh. For your own. I need to feed the dark passenger, or he'll consume me. He's certainly raising the bar. Damn, this guy is good. Son of a whore. I came by to lend a hand, but if that's how you're going to be, I have other ways of spending my time. I'm talking about this hijo de puta, this maricón savage who makes us work on a Friday night. What's the matter, Angel? Afraid of a little blood? Or lack thereof? It's a Friday night. I have my needs. So, como estas? What are you doing here? Saw the police lights. I was in the neighborhood on a date. A date? Nice. We have the same pattern, which means it's the same guy. Bone dry. No blood again. Pero mira aquí. There's some small differences in the cuts this time. Over here, rough, almost emotional. Then over here, not so much. Then over here, clean. Without any blood, it makes my job easy. Look at this hip joint. The top of the femur is all bone. The killer flayed the skin, the flesh, completely off. Now why would he do that? He's clearly experimenting, trying to find the right way. Well, here's a surprise for you. He took the head. I don't find it anywhere here. God knows what he's doing with it. I'll leave that for you to figure out. I'm going back to my date. That's awful, Dexter. Will they catch him soon? Doubtful. This guy is an artist. What do you mean? His technique. It's incredible. The way he cuts. Clean, emotionless, and no blood. Dexter, please. You sound like you admire him. I'd like just one minute to talk to him. Learn about what makes him tick. Dexter, he's a serial killer. You're supposed to catch him, not study him. <sighs> it's late. I should go. Good night. Thank you for dinner. Sleep tight. Help me out here, Dex. LaGuerta still has me interviewing hookers trying to find her.